Hi, Kai. Oh. Hi. Um, I don't think I'll be hearing from you today. Um, what's up? I just thought I'd ring you just to see if you're alright. I mean, I was just watching the first Candid Chat video, and it just seems like you need some information just to kind of cool your nerves a little bit. Because you seem a bit stressed. I mean, that would be helpful. It would. I mean, everything's just so uncertain right now. I'm not really sure how to react to anything. How's everything going? Well, we got some decent news in the past week. Um, also, we actually got confirmation that I, I think it's Pfizer or something. I think it's Pfizer. Yeah. What's that? Uh, well, I think it's like an American or a German pharma- pharmaceutical company. Actually, no, no, that one was BioNTech or BioNTech. They've actually developed a vaccine that's like ninety percent effective, which is mental. Bloody hell! I mean, we we only just got news that things were going into like different stages and stuff. But I don't going really to tears, aren't know they? what that means. Yeah, they've been doing a lot of good work with this vaccine, and you've got to commend everyone. I mean, you did that in your video anyway, but, you know, you went through a lot of turmoil, I think, and uncertainty, so I think you kind of deserve to know some positives about your future and just how the world is. I mean, it would be nice. Um, We kind of got Trump out, but not quite. He's essentially clawing at the floor as we pull him out. Like, Biden won the election this year, decisively. Oh, nice. But it's not without its complications. I'll just... Yeah, but surely if he got the most votes and stuff, then he'll win. Well, he he did, but he also got the most electoral votes as well. But there are people saying that it was all fraudulent and, you know, we don't know anything fully, completely. But it looks to me like he got it legitimately, which is good. So Trump is pretty much gone. I guess that's a positive. I mean, I do hope he does get out. Mm. Well, how about your work? Like, what are you getting on with now? At the moment... Uh, actually, we're in the midst of doing another puppet episode for the Grumps, actually. We're sorting a Christmas one, I think, given the festive season. So Nice, nice. Okay. Have you built any more? We haven't built any more yet, no. It's proving a little difficult as the timeline is kind of crunching inward. They've given us a deadline of December 7th or something. They've got to go on break, obviously. But, yeah, that's going well. We've got a lot more animated stuff in the works. You've been working with Mars. That's all kind of great. But, yeah, it's it's just been it's been a weird year for work. You know, we're constantly trying to keep our savings in line, and I don't know, it's just a bit weird. Like, I'm doing what I love, but I'm so tired. I keep having involuntary naps. <laughs> I'm, I'm losing out time on work, but I know I need to I need to prioritise myself. Yeah, I feel that. Yeah, I mean... The good thing is I've got Emily here telling me to uh, have rest and stuff and to do all that. Yeah, I mean, I've run into a problem at the moment, and why well, you know, I've been falling into this habit of asking whether I worked hard enough at like three in the morning, and I don't think that's healthy. But I'm glad that the year is the way it is. What do you mean? Like it's kind of like a three act structure almost. It's something that you've been looking forward to and hoping for the entire year, Kai. So I totally understand that, and it's nice, you know. We got vaccine news. Hopefully, going to have a decent president in the U.S. who can speak eloquently. So you've got a lot to look forward to, but you've also got a lot to get through. Obviously, you're still to yet enjoy your birthday. That goes really nicely. You get Ben and Jerry's. You know, there's, there's that. Oh, yeah. oh, sorry. No, no, no. It's fine. Revel in it. Revel in it. It's it's fine. Get excited about that kind of stuff. Yeah, I might go for three scoops, actually. i put a candle in my cake. That might be an idea. Yeah, yeah, that's an idea. That's an idea. How's a year in review going? Well, I'm actually recording a video for that now, which is kind of fun. Do you want to say hi? Oh, nice. Wait. Oh, nice, you did like a time loop. Cool. Hi, uh, future people. Have you been jabbed yet? No, we haven't been jabbed yet. I think they're actually looking to get those rolled out by the end of the month, which is great. And I would like to be able to go out and see people around March, you know, have my other birthday then, maybe double it up. But yeah, your interview's going well. We're kind of aiming to end it physically this year in that we want to get Harry over. But, um, you know, lockdown. How's that going? Well, uh, difficult. To say the least. Yeah. It's difficult. We're just trying to figure out how to do it. You know, like I said, we're in another lockdown. Yeah, we're yet to go into one yet, I think. When's the... I, I think... think it's in a couple of days that we officially go into one. Yeah, you go into one on the 21st. You go into that. It doesn't last two weeks. I'll just warn you about that. It doesn't last two weeks. They lie. It kind of got... You come out of that lockdown, and then it just eases and turns into tears. So like you said, it it's all this stuff. But, and it's really confusing, but I'm hoping that after this lockdown we're in, in November, so look forward to that one. Oh, God. 
the year's going well, that we do hopefully get to have people come over again because we're sensible, you know, we're sensible. It's fine. Anyway, it's been nice to talk to you. Yeah, it's been nice to kind of peer through time and see if everything went right. Yeah. Something that I've been wanting to do for ages, so I'll remember to do this one and eventually become you. Yeah, I'm going to get off anyway, but yeah. Um, it's just like a loop of hope, I guess. You know. Yeah. Cool, alright, well, I'll let you get back to it then. Yeah, I'm going to get off too. Emily said she's really excited about what she's got me tomorrow, so that'll be quite fun. I'll tell you this, you use it for a long time. It's very useful. I mean, it's really useful. So, alright, see you in a bit. Bye. Bye. He's gone. That was kind of cool. That's kind of cool. I didn't think um, didn't think Samsung could do that. That felt really good. Because I've been wanting like I've been wanting to hear good news about this year, and we have got it. We've got it in you know the form of November. But I think I think it's a good omen to if you have the ability to time travel like that, go back and use it to make yourself feel better and stuff. Because I, I know I was feeling down. But, uh, yeah, that was nice.